Christian Association of Nigeria, CAN, has directed all churches in Nigeria to advise their members to vote against presidential candidates who have been linked to hard drugs, Boko Haram, corruption, or any violent religious groups before. This was disclosed in a circular which emanated from the Political Strategy Committee of Cannes and was sent to all churches in Nigeria. According to the circular titled 2023 General Elections, whom to vote for, Khan enumerated qualities that the presidential candidate must possess and the policies that should either be implemented or rejected. Among the qualities Khan said Christians should look out for, in a candidate are honesty, fruitfulness, respect for the rule of law, respect for religious and ethnic diversity, compassion, discipline, and credibility. The body said the candidate must not be a member of any court and must not have any involvement with drugs, witchcraft, Boko Haram, or any violent religious group. Khan said the candidate is required to have performed excellently in previous positions, must have education sufficient to manage a complex society and have effective management skills of human and natural resources the secularities offices must be shared fairly to every section of nigeria there must be equal ethnic and religious representation in military and security agencies we say no to the ruga settlement policy and yes to ranching there should be education and free health care for all nigerians including amajiris we reject open grazing rather there should be modernization of animal husbandry, local control of economy, including waters, rivers, and forests. Everyone should control what we have. The candidate must not be a member of any court, must have no involvement in drugs and witchcraft, no fanatism, no relationship to Boko Haram or other violent religious groups. The person must have quality performance in previous positions, good education sufficient to manage a complex society. Even effective management of human and natural resources. The person must have the ability to envision transformation, ability to communicate the vision to diverse peoples, ability to effectively effect the vision of transformation, must be in good health, sound mind, and physical fitness for the job. Hey, hey. wicked. Hmm. Very mature. Nobody no, no name calling. This and this and this and that. You know those who are related with uh, drugs. You know those who have been, you know, talked about uh, those who are related also to Boko Haram and all of those. Is those who are fanatical. Those who do not even consider other people. Those who are so arrogant. To those who cannot. You know, we know them. So, like they always say, a word is enough for the wise. And this is really fantastic. Oh my God, this is really, 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 really fantastic. <laughs> Wonders the sea shall never end. Either has, has yes, let him or her hear what the spirit is saying. That is just all I can say for now. Mm, it is very, 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 very detailed and making sense. Honestly, it is really, really making sense. <laughs> what are you going to be saying? Who is going to say, ah, uh, no, you didn't say the right thing. Huh? Yeah. Better as for me and my family, we will not vote for any party that will promote Boko Haram to the next level. Please note those of you supporting Peter B movement. Hmm. This is a, 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 a strong advice for those who are obedient, those who are supporting OB movement. What you need to do is you should kindly educate Nigerians on how to vote. Most people didn't recognize Labour Party logo. Try educate the people. That's a good one. That's a good one. Can should keep quiet and vote for the candidates of their choice. Peaceful. Are they talking to you? They are talking to the members of the Christian as uh, Christian. Those they are talking to Christians. Uh, so what is your problem? They have told them those that they need to vote for. Uh -huh. They wrote to all churches. Are you part of the church? Uh -huh. You are not a, a church member or you are not a Christian. So why should you be bothered? They are telling their people who to vote for. You say someone said their hypocrisy is beyond imagination. They disallowed Muslim students not to use hijab in government schools across the southwest Nigeria. At the same time, they went to radio station preaching religion tolerance. We are in the area of democracy. Let's vote for the candidates of that of our choice. Ah, of their choice. That is that not what they are saying? Did they tell Nigerians? They are telling church members. They are telling church members. They are not telling you to. They are not talking to you. <laughs> 
Okay, well, thank you so very much for saying it the way it is. Uh, intervene and intercede for us all appropriately. What are you saying? You've not said anything. Are you, what are you commending? Hmm. Alimi, I've met uh, Afonja. Seafood and Ijanja with sense. To the advantage. So we should vote for bandits as Aousa people is now giving them to ban titles. Shame to many in the north who like evil instead of good things. Aren't you not aware of what is happening in Nigeria? Why insulting can? Can you say that Say that to your imams? Keep supporting Boko Haram and evildoers. You are minding these uh, hypocrites. They can share their flyer to you, but can't collect your own. They can invite you to their church in the name of program, but they can come to your they can't come to yours. They just want to come open and tell people not to vote in Ah who can't mention Tinumbu now not to vote for Tinumbu. They think they have the financing. <laughs> who mentioned Tinumbu now? Yeah? Is Tinubu related to all these things that they have talked about? Hey, go and tell that to the imams who feed their members like you with hatred and tell them to vote only Muslim. You are now willing because Christians have woken up to understand that God will not come down to do for them what they should do for themselves. In 2023, you will will even more a disgrace to goodwill. Nobody mentioned anybody. <laughs> They don't mention anybody. They don't say somebody will say this. They say those who are related, who have a affiliation with all those, uh, or who, in one way or the other, have that kind of attribute or whatever to that. Uh, those are uh, things that they have listed. So, eh, they talk to you. They call you. Why they can say not to, not to vote for Tinubu? <laughs> so you really want to vote Tinubu as a president in this unity in this country? I really pity any person below the age of fifty years and wants a man of ninety six years and seek to be his president when we have more healthy and competent people to handle this country. If you go down that lane using threats and see him by population Christians as number the Muslims, then we go no who go shock. Even without religion, I can't even vote a ne a near ninety year old man as my president. Then use old people swear for us. They use anti swear for us. Have you uh, out of true conscience, invited any of any from other faiths to an Islamic occasion that I doubt that I doubt because I live in the north and none of my Muslim friends have invited me for an Islamic occasion as aside weddings. Don't use your mediocre, mediocre, mediocre attitude because uh, you have one cheap Android phone to comment on issues uh, you have zero knowledge of. Well. Since Nigerians are renowned for making poor choices with regards to leaders they vote for, it is time for them to be guided to make the right decision for once. And that is what this whole thing is all about. They should also condemn political aspirants with hyperblink and insecurity. No wahala. Bola went to US drug baron, Shetima, current stakeholder of Boko Haram. Can I hear you? An elder man used type. Style, bust and pursue bad picking for family house. We are voting a candidate that breeds moral Christians in leadership aside giving Christians fair representation. I'm not even voting Christian or Muslim, but I'm voting Ashwajibola Abetinubu and Senator Kashim Shetima. Congratulations to you. Mm. Their conscience is already fighting them. Khan said we shouldn't vote for anyone with a link with drugs and Boko Haram. They didn't mention names though. And some people feel attacked. <laughs> there no mention them more, but they are fidgeting now. Uh huh. So, guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you.